A few days ago, I watched Logan Browning's hair tutorial. Logan mentioned how she didn't know her hair type because there's a mixture of loose and tight curls throughout her head. Now, I know you can relate to this and so can I. Your curly hair is so versatile and to know Logan Browning's hair type or find your own is not easy. Now, if you struggle with shrinkage, dry hair, or lack of definition, you know how different your curls can look depending on the angle someone's looking at or what styling products you use that day. Knowing how to style curly hair is very important to get moisturized, shiny curls throughout your entire head. I'm going to show you a quick curly hair routine that gives you soft, beautiful curls in five minutes so you can get out the door confident and on time. If you struggle to define your curls or easily keep your natural hair moisturized for days, this video is for you. All right, y'all, so we have the clock running for five minutes. And first, what we're gonna do is spritz your hair with some water. I just have some cold water in this bottle. Y'all see I done upgraded with this little mister, okay? <laughs> I got my sis in the background, y'all. <laughs> Done beat my face as well. What's going on, y'all? <laughs> All right, y'all, so the first product I'm gonna use is the Affigy Keratin and Green Tea Restructurizer. This is great for a little protein boost throughout your hair. Getting those ends, getting throughout. Now, y'all already know what's coming next, okay? So we're going to be using my favorite product. This is the Jazz Up My Curls Grape Seed Buttercream Hair Moisturizer. This right here, fabulous, okay? For all hair textures, all curly hair types. So if you struggle to define your curls or keep them moisturized and you struggle with dry hair, this product is for you. So I'm gonna take a good little amount of that and start off at my edges and then hitting that kitchen, okay ladies? And then we're going to go in with some slight sections, okay? Because remember, this is a quick routine. Now, if you want your curls to last throughout the day, you wanna make sure that even if you're in a rush, get in between your hair, y'all. Get inside, because all that tends to happen is it's going to start to frizz out throughout the day. So you wanna make sure you get that moisture in from the jump so you don't have to worry about frizzy curls at the end of the day. So taking a little bit more product, if you see here on my hands, it happens. Comment below y'all if you struggle with shedding when you're doing your hair. All right, y'all, taking a little bit more, taking that through, hitting those ends, hit the ends of your curls always. Even if you're in a rush, y'all, taking those extra few seconds to clump your curls is key, okay? Not only does this guarantee better product distribution, keeping your curls moisturized for days, but also just giving you better definition. So make sure you clump those curls, rake, rake, rake. All right, so as you can see, this is the one side looking nice and juicy, nice and clump. Compared to the other side, which we have not styled yet. You can see there's a lot of frizz and looking dry, looking like it needs some moisture. So let's fix that, okay? <laughs> Thank you. 
Once you have finished styling your hair, there are three different things that you can do to help your hair to dry faster. Number one, you can take a t-shirt, and some of you may know this as the plopping method. You take your hair, dip it over, put it in the t-shirt or a microfiber towel, and that's gonna soak up excess water in your hair so your hair can dry a little bit faster. Now number two, you can take a diffuser. My diffuser unfortunately has broke. Okay, I either use it like this to just get into the roots a little bit on warm or cool setting low speed or I will take off the attachment as a whole and just go around my hair a little bit for a few minutes and then hit those ends inside and let it dry. And the number three way to dry your hair is to just let it air dry outside. So because it is late and I am trying to get my hair to dry a little bit faster, I'm going to be diffusing my hair today, okay? And of course, diffusing is going to allow you to get out the door faster. So unfortunately, the extension cord is too short for me to show y'all how I diffuse on camera. So if you wanna see a video of me showing you how to diffuse your hair for less to no frizz and nice to find soft curls, then just comment below, give this video a like, and I'll be sure to do that for y'all, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse my hair and I will be back with you final beautiful full voluminous results okay y'all so don't go nowhere all right y'all so as you can see these are the final results looking nice shiny bouncy lovely okay and it took me about 30 minutes to diffuse it just depends on your hair porosity if you'd like to know your own hair porosity i do have a blog post on that so i'll link that in the description box below this video now if you are interested in the jazz up my curls grapeseed buttercream then you can click the link right below this video now this is a special promotion i'm doing for my good old subscribers who've been hanging in here with me i have a special discount and promotion for you all to get free shipping on your orders as well as discounts on bulk orders so if you are interested in stocking up on your grapeseed buttercream and go ahead and click that link below this video but make sure you're subscribed okay if you are not subscribed don't click the link all right <laughs> so i love you all so much thank you so much for watching god bless you and i will see you in the next video bye y'all